from technologies that didn't exist 10, 20, 30 years ago to treat things such as cardiovascular disease, so heart valve technologies. Many of those early technologies required very invasive surgery, open heart surgery, that can't even be done in some of the frailest and sickest of patients. To today, minimally invasive technologies that can be performed and a patient can be out of their hospital bed and even home within days. So innovation is not only a snapshot in time, it's a trajectory, it's a pace, and it's trends that we've seen across cardiovascular, across cancer care, across pain management that doesn't stop. And there's still so much more promise for tomorrow if we have the right types of policies in place here in Washington and across the country to, that appreciates and understands and really promotes innovation.